I've discussed this a little bit before. Got some videos on it. Uh, I don't know that I showed the machining on the drum. This is a Turbo 400 style Drake drum that is machined to accept a different inner race that's made. Goes on there, gets pressed on, sits down on that hex. So it's like a big socket grabbing a big bolt. And it gets set down on that drum and pressed on so that it can hold the larger 36 element sprag for a pro mod or super drum, whichever phrase you like to use. Same same thing. It's an improved OEM piece. Um, a lot of the aftermarket aluminum, chromoly, titanium drums use the big sprag. They're also available with the standard 34 element sprag. But just to give some, some idea, you can see the lube channel in there. And then the hex part that holds it on. There's several different ways to attach this to the drum. We actually are working on doing a pinned setup for uh, our own drums. We're buying these races already done and building these drums right now because of the, the market conditions where we can't buy these drums in quantity like we would like to. So we're making them in-house like we did in the past. But maybe uh, you can see you got a groove machine in the drum. you got a face here that's machined down to the proper dimension so that everything spaces out right. You have the hex that keeps that from spinning when the, when the thing gets, uh, when it loads the sprag on a one-two shift or any other time. And then this surface has to be, has to be machined for, you know, a fairly tight fit to keep the oil going into the lube circuit. So you have to start with a, a, you know, a serviceable direct drum and then cut everything down to use an inner race on there and then the, the associated parts with the big sprag and the larger outer race like that and uh, the different backing plate. But some, some folks have kind of asked about what you have to do to do that. It's not, a, it's not something you're going to do in your garage at the house. It's a pretty, pretty complex machining operation. With, uh, with all the parts that are associated with it, these things, you know, you gotta got to be hardened to a pretty hard spec. You have to be made out of a, a bearing grade material. So you can't just, even if you had the parts to do it, the machining is not, not a simple task.